Welcome to season eight. We made it. Yay. Um, I have I have some good news and some bad news, ladies and gentlemen. Good news is we made it to season eight. Huzzah! How fortuitous for us all. The bad news is it's no more. They took out the best map in the whole game. I just love that map so much. I just I loved it so much. Oh, okay. All right, we gotta we gotta go on the stream. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Gauntlet from season one for the first time tonight. Badger Man has the record of two minutes and fifty seconds, and now my mouth is awake and ready to go. Let's see what we have here. We got Mega Golden Lucario and Avavani. On the left hand near side, we have Tim Reaper all alone on the left hand side, middle. Fruit Body Berserk neck and neck on the far back side. Shensi and Babazoon also on the back side, neck and neck, and official sunlight all on their own on the right hand side, all coming up to the center of the vortex orbiter. We're going to see what our players have in store for us on this long and challenging course. Shensi with a very good elliptical orbit trying to weave and bob into the center of opponent returns. Official sunlight also with a very good line trying to weave and bob as well, but having a little bit of trouble as they get blasted out by Fruit Body and Tim Reaper. Shensi holding that line for now, but now on the inside is official sunlight. It looks like Shensi and official sunlight are going to be the first ones to. Trying to hold on to that early lead. Can they get through? Yes, official suddenly already hitting the point of return. Shenzi not far up. It looks like Tim Reaper has a better gun. And they've already gotten into the dishwasher. And they're going to be in first place. But Shenzi straight through the dishwasher. He's going to be coming in first place. Watch out for Shenzi on this course. I told you. Tim the Reaper trying to get out in second. But they're not able to get through the exit with a lot of speed. And Berserk is going to overtake in second place. Shenzi in first place with a huge lead on the right hand side of that divide. Berserk coming right down the center trying to make up some ground on Shenzi Tim Reaper in third on the left hand side. Fruit on the left hand side in fourth place. And now we have Mabazoon trying to get around the dishwasher. Finally getting their bearings on this dishwasher. I think they finally had enough to drink and the buzz is wearing off and they're getting themselves back together in fifth place on the left hand side but Chess TV already back up into the mergers here path the pistons beautifully into the industrial potato pillar will they go for one of the tricks on this course or will they just take it safe and send it no they go for the trick and Chess TV has skipped the funnel completely once again and Chess TV showing why they dominate on this course has got into the pins I told you to watch out for Chess TV on this course they are not holding back tonight at all but Zerk in second place trying to get through the industrial potato pillar into the funnel now and Tim Reaver still holding in third place as they both go into the funnel but Chess TV already threw the collar into the dishwasher and they're going to get a very feral bounce from the blade if they can find the exit. No, they cannot. And Shen's TV losing a little bit of time in this dishwasher, and this could spell trouble for Shen's TV. All the, as the record time for Badger Man showing to catch up from behind right now. But I think Shen's TV is finally going to find the exit here, but not a lot of speed. No, they missed the exit once again. And Tim Reaper and Berserk now catching up from behind into the calendar already. Avovani trying to catch up from behind. And Tim Reaper with a straight shot through the dishwasher is overtaking Shen's TV. It looks like Shen's TV got a little too comfortable with their lead and has squandered it all in that dishwasher. And now Tim the Reaper in first place as they come around the second bend of the merged triple helix. Chesney V still stuck in that dishwasher, and now the other players are all catching up from behind. Fusion Potty trying to get through, but they get swiped around by the blade. Mega Golden Car, it looks like they're going to be the second one through. Mama Zoon going to be in third. Chesney V finally out of the dishwasher in fourth place, and then official sunlight now going to be in fifth place. And Fusion Potty, Berserk, and Avavani all looking to catch up from behind. But let's go back to the leader, which is Tim Reaper, who's coming across the moguls now, trying to get through and caught up to that record time. They have to get past all these pistons without getting stopped up, or the other players are going to have a chance to catch up from behind. Tim Reaper getting bossed up by that second set of pins. They're trying to get around the bend now, and it looks like they have a good line and good timing, and they're going to be well on their way in first place. Official Sunlight getting knocked out of the merch Triple Helix. I've actually never seen that happen before. And a poor fate for Official Sunlight. Rest in peace. Mega Golden Card in second. Mama's in third. Chesapeake in fourth. But let's go back to Tim Reaper as they line it up for the jump. Will they have the good line or will they have the good momentum? No, they have some right-hand momentum, but Tim Reaper is going to lose that first place finish with a very bad line on that jump, and they have been eliminated. Now, Mega Golden Lucario looking to take first place once again with Mama Zoon hot on their heels. The Mom Squad looking to challenge the Mega Squad, and what is going to happen here? Mega Golden Lucario looking to set up the jump with good left-hand momentum. Mama Zoon trying to set that center line, but they overshoot it, and they have been eliminated. Esther says he has missed the line completely, and Mega Golden Lucario, the solo survivor of that jump in the leading pack, has taken first place. 
yet again for the third time here tonight. Frusha Ponte surviving the jump is going to come across the line in second place. And now we're just down to Avo and Berserk. Avo with a huge lead on Berserk trying to line it up for the jump. Will they stick the landing? They're going down the center. That might be too much speed. And it is. And Avo Vani not heeding the recommendation of Louisiana Jones has fallen off in the map. And Berserk, also an experienced player here, is going to stick the landing and come across the bin in third place. And that is the race, ladies and gentlemen. Soon. Last race for Mama Zoon. Last race for the Mom Squad. Looks like uh, Mega Golden Lucario is going to survive here. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Twisted Toothpick for the first time tonight from Season 3. Ekno the Nido has the record of a minute and 38 seconds. A very tough time to beat. His average run time is 2 to 2 and a half minutes. Let's see what our players have in store for us here tonight. Looks like we have Berserk, Just a Fad, Fushipate, Lomri on the left hand side. Chesapeake, Mamazoon, Mega Golden Lucario, Jose the Great and Ghost Mustache on the right hand side. Looks like Ghost Mustache once again be the first one out of the vertical pinball bar, but Jose the Great with a little bit more line and momentum as they come out of that line. And they're going to be in first place, going around the right hand side into the Twisted Toothpicks. Ghost Mustache in second, Mega Golden Lucario on third. Mama's in fourth. Just a fan of fifth. Future Pond day six. Or, I think, yes. Chance to be in seventh. Or Berserk in seventh. Chance to be in eighth. But we're going to get to those players in just a moment as we go through the rest of the course here. Looks like Jose Great is going to be the first one. No. Gold Rose Mustache is the first one boosted into the Newton's Zimmer. But all players having a little bit of trouble against top seven in the second layer of Pendulums here. Who's going to get through? Looks like Just a fan of Ghost Mustache trying to push through on the left hand side. And it looks like Mega Golden Lucario also been once again in third place. God damn it. Mega Golden Lucario. Ghost Mustache holding on first yet again as they go into the second twisted toothpick. Justin Fan is second place. And now we have Mega Golden and still holding third, but they're having a little bit of trouble almost falling out of the uh, twisted toothpick there. I've never seen someone get stuck up like that. Lewis Mustache and Just a Fan getting into the colander as quickly as possible, but it looks like Just a Fan is going to have the better pin bounce, and they're going to be able to overtake the Mustache here, and all the other players are looking to catch up in by for that colander. Just a Fan not able to get out of the dishwasher, and Mama's in a little too much speed, has been bobbled out by the dishwasher. They've been a little berserk, saved by the booster, trying to get through as quickly as possible on that left-hand side, but they are not able to find the exit. Just a Fan also trying to get through. Looks like Just a Fan might be able to find the exit pretty quickly here, but Mega Golden Lucario coming up from behind, already through the dishwasher into the wall picker, and they could finally be getting their first-place finish if they could just stick the landing after this jump across the balance beam. Mega Golden Lucario going for it, but a little bit too anxious. A little too <laughs> much for their own good. Has over hit the top of the wall. Bounce out of the map. It has been eliminated. Is that just because they were too anxious, or was there foul play from the mom squad? Who knows? Just a fan. Finally catching their speed on those pins to keep themselves from falling off of the map, and they're going to hold first place for now. Fushipati trying to catch up from behind in second place, but Berserk with a beautiful bounce off of the pins coming down the side. And look at this daring line from Berserk, skipping the entire slides with only two bounces of Berserk, retaking first place all across the other places. They're going to the line. In first place, Jeff Just a Fan now going to have to fill for second. Glorious Mustache catching up from behind, now going to be finishing in third. Fushipati for the Laura Marie with way too much speed coming around that bend there. Has been eliminated, falling out of the map. And Jose the Great, Chesa V, bringing it up in the rear. Chesa V trying to pass over the Great right at the end, not to be last, but who's going to come across the line first? It could be Chesa V, it could be Jose the Great. It looks like it is Chesa V coming across the line in fifth. And Jose the Great bringing up the rear in sixth place. And that is the race, ladies and gentlemen. What happened to Tim Reaper? I guess it just wasn't his cup of tea.